Alrighty. We are back. Going to continue on this area here. Winding down, but still some major challenges lie ahead. Alright, I think I'm going to start by simply putting in the kind of upper border of this one starting over here this thing kind of starts right here I believe right here Double check that. One, two, three, down. <sighs> yeah, that's right. Okay, right here. Kind of comes down. Kind of curves down and comes right here. Just leave that for now. Not gonna do much there. Let's just make sure this is all. All right, then let's start here. I think we pretty much did wrap up that thing yesterday. Um, let's uh start by kind of um making the lower border of this got this um sort of green we'll use this okay so we got this green we'll use this sort of light olive kind of coming up here down nice and kind of smooth and then just slowly getting slightly closer to the other side and kind of just let's get this uh Got well, let's come over here now. Let's get some of these lines. So, over here, let's see, we got about one, two more. Yeah, so the green kind of. I feel like we screwed something up here. Ah, we did. We did screw up. Son of a bitch. Ugh. Amazing, even when you got the grid lines there, 
you still screw it up. All right, let's just bring it over. Over here is where it starts to come up. Comes up and comes back down. No big deal, okay. Easy to fix. So then we got it kind of coming over here. put a little bit I've got this sort of blue in here let's make it a little darker and then over here I'll make it a little more gray and I'm running into there so, and that'll be kind of our stopping point for now on the limit alright let's um vacuum Let's put some of this pale well, over here. We've got a little more gray to kind of, kind of, kind of put right here. And then it kind of becomes this sort of, let's put this sort of lighter color in here. And this is going to be kind of almost white in here. Kind of put this. Dun, 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 dun. And then this is kind of stops. So we need to put, I would say, a little hint of green. And over here, just a little bit. Over here, we actually need to put a tiny bit of blue in here, just a little bit. And then let's put a little bit of white kind of just lighten it up just a bit and then let's kind of just lighten up this stuff over here too okay that's actually sort of okay now let's all right so what on earth is going on over here so look we've got these sort of stripes and we're just gonna have to just pick a freaking color and just kind of put them in there so we're going to use this dark olive first to kind of make this backbone for this kind of very irregular and let's kind of just bring it over here. Probably wouldn't be a terrible idea to take the grid lines out as we went, but let's just let's screw it for now. All 
All right, so over here, it kind of starts to kind of become this sort of brownish looking. Um, and then it just kind of stops. Just kind of over here, kind of peters out there. Kind of has this sort of brownish tinge, but you know, not gonna make. Hmm. Okay, so look now down here, we kind of have a similar thing. So we've got some of this darker stuff just kind of filling up kind of just down here kind of heading this way kind of just disappearing out here and actually over here and I got this sort of this going like that. Let's make this a little have a little more body down here. Now over here it kind of curves up and you kind of got this thing that goes up this way just very very subtle and not well defined sort of I think alright so let's do this thing up here so up here you've got this sort of kind of thing Let's use this, um, let's use this sort of gray. This stuff kind of just becomes gray up here. And we'll just kind of, uh, actually same thing up here. This thing just kind of switches colors all of a sudden. Just leave that for now. Let's try and follow these couple of things over here. What's this? Where was this going? Right here? And it kind of just goes up here. Kind of just comes over here. And then kind of comes here and just kind of stops right there. Alright, then this thing, the lower one. This comes up to about right there. And then this kind of comes up and just kind of stops right there. So let's take our lighter olive. And let's kind of just throw in these little things over here. So you just kind of get this very 
very subtle kind of patch of color kind of coming in here like this and then it's kind of and then over here it kind of changes to gray let's get the gray kind of just comes up straight to here Then it just comes across here, kind of forms this stripe, and then right here it just kind of stops, and then you have that raindrop under it. Let's go back up here, fill in this thing, kind of comes right off of here goes this way what the f this thing is supposed to be that thing Continuing This thing comes up here Right up here Comes across here Sometimes you just, I swear, sometimes it's totally off. And when I say totally, I mean off. It's annoying. We were supposed to be over here. This thing was coming off here. It was kind of forming a stripe. So that means that when I did this, I screwed that up. Total screw up. <sighs> All right, so this. came up here and it kind of came there and just stopped
coming off of here. Right here we got some nice patches of this bright green kind of coming up here. Let's kind of just add some of this bright green to all of Let's add a little bit of this to all this because really this darker olive ain't just Alright, now let's start filling in all this stuff back here. Let's take all the grid lock. Don't need them anymore. Back in a lot of this. Okay. All right, now let's put some of this lighter green stuff, lighter all kind of along here, and then I come here, now let's take this chalk. And smudge some of that into the background of this stuff. Just kind of into here. And then we'll add some yellow on top of that. I actually need to take a little bit more of the Where's that light gray? Kind of need it. <sighs> All right, now let's take a little more of this stuff. I think I can kind of put it back, back around on most of this junk. Kind of up through here. It's not until over here it starts to become more gray brown. Kind of between this green is where it can be green. That's okay. Now let's put a fair amount of yellow in there. 
see if it'll actually brighten it. I think it should. just need a tiny touch of this darker green just kind of some of these stripes and when I say a little bit we're gonna smudge it in pretty good I mean can you even fathom the trash you have to listen to to try to listen to YouTube I mean they will not spare you So what do we got over here? We've got these bluer areas. Actually, let's, yeah, yeah, let's do the blue. We've got a nice big, actually decent sized chunk we can deal with underneath here. Let's take this olive and draw the border of this. So, I'll be real light with it. Just leave that for now. Let's take the blue, this light blue, kind of fill in some of these areas that are going to have this bluish tinge. gonna be this sort of this little thing right there Alright, so right 
here. I've kind of got this greenish. Let's put in a little bit of. There's our little bitty light green pencil. Right here. Some of this in here. And then we've got some of this blue in here. Let's put some of this in here. And kind of under here, there's a little hint of it as well. And then Right on in between here, kind of come like this. Kind of like this sort of flat. Just a little bit of it there. And then definitely some of it kind of in here. So over here, I've got some of this color on this side. We don't really need to, I don't think we need to really represent that. It's just light area. I don't think it's really, I will say this, there is this hint of brown right in here. Here, let's, where's our brown chalk? God, son of, and I have got so much crap on this table. It's getting out of hand. I know we had a brown chalk. What the happened to it? Just put this in there. That's fine. Okay. Let's um, smudge some of this in. Smudge this in. So I think what we need under these areas over here, we're just gonna actually put a fair wire. We gotta get the good lines out of here. Good lines gone. My grid lines. <sighs> All right, here's what we're going to do. Let's put Some of this light green in here. And obviously this ain't the right color, but we're gonna darken it. We'll add something on top of it.
I think I know how I'm gonna do it. a chalk that I thought was kind of olive-ish. I thought I found one that I was like, oh, this is what I should have been using. <whistles> nope. Well, if I did, it's gone. Alright, let's put... Let's actually... Let's... Let's actually try to be done with this. Okay, so we're up here. sort of brown stuff. Can't really say what the heck is going on. It's the same or everything right here Continue on with this light green for now. Having already stated this is not the right color. Ah. I mean, we really are going to have to make this significantly grayer and darker. I mean, that's the bottom one. Because, I mean, it's basically in a shadow. And it has to look almost as dark as that shadow sliver we did yesterday. quickly add you know honestly I think we're gonna add the dark olive this really does need to be well you know what let's use the light one let's use the light one and we're just how are we gonna do it we're just gonna have to be patient and kind of just go over the whole thing Let me sharpen it. Uh, 
All right, let's just go. Use this side. I've never really done this. Not quite like this. What the? Let's go in with that darker blue now. Kind of darken up sort of. Let's not get too crazy with that. Let's just... <clears throat> kind of just mix that in a little bit. So what do we got? We got this whole thing needs to look grayer. So let's get the gray and make this all a touch. Let's not use the dark one. Let's use this uh, middle, middle gray and just kind of
Let's get that gray, uh, yeah, kind of accentuate this sort of thing, kind of right here. I mean, it really becomes. go back over some of this stuff with this sort of lighter blue. Try this chalk. And there's a fair amount of this. You've got this sort of honestly everything under here kind of has this blue tinge. We need um so maybe just some effort to kind of come in between these areas now again with this olive and kind of reestablish that. Vacuum some of that. I feel like there's some sort of yellow when you kind of throw. Just blue 
So there's a sort of like around this kind of thing. All right, let's um finish this area and then we'll be done for today. And we're not done. We still got to come back over here and do more there, but I feel like we're getting something done for once. Let's use, man, this is a very subtle. All right, you got a couple, kind of a striped thing coming through here. This thing. Kind of becomes gray over here, to be honest. So then right here, I've got this thing. I mean, these are obviously very subtle. Then up here, you've got another one. Coming right here. Let's take the grid lines out. Let's vacuum first. Once again, I want to reiterate, I thought this flower was white. <laughs> I guess it's not. All right, grid lines. Bye bye, grid lines.
vacuum that. I think the first thing we need to do, let me put that little thing right there. All right, we need to put a little tiny faint light green background. And I mean faint. Now that's probably not, that's already too not faint. Tell you. <whistles> Same thing over here. Not, not nearly as much. Let's put some yellow. Some yellow in here. Not too much, just a little bit. Let's take our gray again and kind of accentuate these sort of stripes we're trying to make. Kind of. But we don't want them to be too well defined. This thing we kind of do. And really, okay, and this is subtle. All right, let's take some light gray. Where's the lightest one we have? This one. Put a little bit of that in here. Now, a little more yellow in here. Now let's take the white. Where's the white chalk? Let's actually um, kind of just stick it on here. It never hurts to just kind of take the white and just go kind of like this. Or does it? Backing 
Uh, let's take some of this. Just kind of just put in some little. Cut these sort of like as these white speckles, but of course, said a hundred times, this really doesn't work until it's fixed, and even then, it doesn't work. Fact is, the white just never is a miracle. It ain't no miracle cure. That little bit of white kind of around here. And kind of around here. Let's take the darker gray, just kind of put a little crap in here. Although, that really don't work because it's not the shade. This thing actually is supposed to look green. Um, let's see something. Let's see if we can erase any of this. I'm not gonna do jack shit. Nope. That's okay. Um, maybe one last thing we'll do before try to just make all this just a little grayer up here. Not way, way grayer, but just a little bit. It does need to have a gray. Um, something for sure. Alright. Let's take that blue. Let's just kind of go in here, put a little bit, just kind of this sort of haziness, especially down here. Just a little bit more. All right, we don't need to make a big deal. I think um, I think next time we'll let's see something here. Alright, next time we'll start with this thing. Make this all a little less dramatic. Yeah, we need to yeah, we'll start with this thing and finish this and go up that way. I think this was a decent start to this area.